stop shopping at five below until after you've watched this video. Three in one hair styler that kind of looks like a Dyson. I have this Dyson. It's a little bit different, but it's a little bit the same. And it was only $20. Y'all better get over there immediately. Five Below has the most unique products in their store. Like if you're confused, like I am 90% of the time, and you're looking for a gift for somebody, and you're like, I don't know what to buy them. Walk through a Five Below. Something's gonna jump out at you. They have unique products at a fair price. Now the quality is eh, but they're unique. It's not like the same thing you see everywhere else. Like this, how cute is this? This is a great little gift for $20 dollars it's a good little gift and I hope it's not plasticky and it looks used I should put that away the Dyson because it's gonna embarrass this guy it's not even fair this is a three-in-one hair styler dryer curler and hot air brush oh <laughs> uh -uh. never mind <laughs> no. And the chrome, extra shiny. Y'all didn't need to do all that. There are scratches all over. This is getting returned. How can I give this to somebody? They're already going to say, did you go buy me a $20 blow dryer at five below when you have a Dyson and it's used? <laughs> and this is the really cool attachment that looks very much like a Dyson. Wow. I'm afraid I'm going to break it if I keep shoving it in there. Whoa. Gentle. Designed just like a Dyson. It even has like the little filter down here, just like the Dyson does. Dyson weighs a good five pounds. This one weighs about three ounces. <laughs> but who cares as long as it blow dries your hair. Let's see. It's loud as hell. So it doesn't blow from the side where it's like chromed out. It blows from this side. It has a cool setting for like a cool blast. And then it has two hot settings. You also get these two attachments, one rolling attachment. And then this, I don't use these kind of attachments. So I'm not sure what they're for, but you get those. These are the main things that we want to try. Now, I don't mean to be a salesperson for Dyson, but if you need a recommendation, I can definitely recommend it. You will love it. It will last you forever if you're good to it. So we'll try the ping pong test with the Dyson on low so you guys can see that was on low on our Dyson let's see what we get out of this guy it is so loud but you guys can see the power of that guy right one more time for the kids in the back of the room low on both you don't even want to see what high is we'll try high on this one just for fun but you guys can see the power with the ping pong ball and it totally vibrates. It's $20, but I might even say just save the 20 bucks and go get you like a Con Air. Those things will last you for a lifetime and they're about 20, 25 bucks. Unfortunately, after using it and doing my little ping pong test and this mess here that makes it look used, this is totally getting returned and I think you should skip it. I don't think it's worth even the 20 bucks. So for all of those reasons, I'm gonna give the Dyson dupe one. I was going to say zero, but a hot air comes out of it. Aroma diffuser with a little unicorn whale. What are those called? I thought we couldn't put aromas in diffusers because the fungalitis will grow. That might be a rumor that I just started. I thought you're supposed to just put like clean water in there. <gasps> Does it change colors? Oh, look at the side. How cute is this? Doubles as a soft glowing nightlight for a co-worker for their desk. Is that allowed? Uh-oh. Feels plasticky, but let's see. Oh, it comes with the aroma. I did see another style of it with a different little animal inside, but I don't know if there was different colors. White tea essential oil is included. It's a little silicone. Why does everything look used? There's like little scratches on this guy. So you're gonna get your cord, you plug it into the back. I'm gonna fill it to the top of this, about right there. I think you need to give yourself some space for this little piece here. And I think I already jacked it up. Couple drops of this. I hadn't smelled white tea before, but it smells really lovely. <laughs> It does make me nervous to have water filled things next to a kid's bed. If they knock it over or something. It's not working. Okay, I'm gonna unplug it. Nothing. I think it stays plugged in because it's working plugged in now. Let's turn off some lights. How cute it is. Oh, what a fail. Can you even see the little guy in there? <laughs> it looks like a, like a dead fish. There he is in blue, but it's supposed to be rainbow. Okay, so it's flipping through the colors. I'm gonna take back everything I said in the beginning. Oh, a second ago, it was about to start with the little thing, but never mind. Don't go to Five Below for gifts. Everything's real cute. They do a great job of like marketing and packaging and the idea, but half of the stuff don't work. Half of the stuff is like 
plasticky and like, no, it's not even as advertised is what's pissing me off. Nothing is happening. Absolute fail. Very upset. I want a refund and extra for the hassle. You know how some stores do that where they do like a money back guarantee plus a little something, something. <laughs> like y'all need to pay me a little something, something for the hassle. And all the cheering that I did for you guys in the beginning, because this is the second product in this video that has been, but somewhat of a flop. Just leave this in the store. So I'm going to give the little diffuser, even though it smelled really nice, zero Vivian heads. Foot massaging pillow. There's nothing that I love more than a foot massage. When I saw this in the store, I thought, buy yourself a gift, Vivian. You deserve it. Five Below has let me down. I am disappointed. I am retiring them from the circulation or the roster. You can't have me spending, I think I spent like 70 bucks. Gifts are unique, but if I'm having to return stuff because they don't freaking work, never mind. Like, that's gas money going up there. Now this one, where is it right here? Be well. I actually have my scale. It's from this company. So I imagine this is possibly fingers crossed decent. For $15, it didn't seem too hard. Horrible. <laughs> oh my God. Battery operated, high frequency vibration, dual massage mode. It comes in blue, two speeds, 15 bucks. That's a pretty good deal. It's a cute color too. I haven't had a video where every single product has failed miserably. If this is a first, this went from, I love the store, unique gifts, go buy something, ha ha ha, ki ki ki, <laughs> to expose. Absolutely, we're not going to you anymore. Piss me off. Why do we have a zipper at the bottom? Okay, batteries, super basic, but listen, it doesn't gotta be fancy to be decent. Remember, $15. We always set the expectation based on the price. Okay, we got the screw out to put the batteries in. I know this didn't say I needed C batteries. Do those even exist anymore? <laughs> You better be glad that I'm Vivian tries. Otherwise, who's gonna have that? I think I have some in my doomsday bag. <laughs> Told you I had some. <laughs> Don't ask why I have random stuff like this. You never know. That's why if it would have been bug out day, we haven't talked about bug out day in a minute. Have you watched that new show on Netflix? Leave the world behind. So I ate that right up. <laughs> and prepped again. Hey, my batteries are in, but we got to get back on our refreshing our bug out bags. Update me in the comments down below. Let me know how you're doing on your bug out bag, what you got in it. If you're still in the crew, turn it on. It's a vibrator. It's not a massager. I don't hate it but I don't love it. It's loud as hell. That is not discreet. It feels really good though. It's gonna be a great gift, you guys. I'm saying more than just a foot massager. Don't get crazy with it. Maybe a neck massager? Why can't you put your neck on it? The back of your neck, not the front of your neck. It could be an arm massager. It's vibrating all the way in there, but you should be placing your foot like this long ways. I'm on the fence. I don't know if I love it, if I hate it. And I keep going, $15 though, Vivian. You can't have high expectations. This is not Brookstones. It has a high and low mode and they seem to be the same, low <laughs> or maybe high. I don't know, but I don't hear a difference. The color's cute. Mm, I don't want to recommend it because I feel like you're not going to love it and you're thinking it's going to give you some like, you know those massagers with the little balls that are like massaging you? Yeah, the, not that. Not at all. This is just like getting a vibration from the loud noise that's coming out of it. That's really what this is. Buy this for your white elephant gift. That's probably what it's good for. Something like that. Somebody will be impressed with it when they pick it from the pile of gifts. But then when they get home, <laughs> they're going to hate it and be like, I understand why it was a white elephant gift. It's not that great. Quality wise, mm. so for all of those reasons, I'm gonna give the foot massager to Vivian Heads. Buzz Lightyear from Toy Story, who does not love, that's the best movie ever on earth. Even though it says $10, they were half price already. I think they might be marking down some of the Christmas stuff. I'm just assuming it might just be this guy. I don't know, but I asked that in my last five below video. Like, do they mark down like right after Christmas? Do they do that 90% off crap? From some of the comments I read, I believe they do do that. So instead of 10, it's only five and it is a remote control I believe wings pop out automatically walks forward I've had such bad experience so far that I'm like it probably doesn't do any of this stuff remote control figure for five dollars that was the best deal in the store who does not love Buzz Lightyear he's so cute I was looking around for Woody but I did not see a Woody around or I would have bought the pair if more than 50% of the products in my video do not work I'm gonna stop going to five below enough's enough it's super cute though 
quality is not bad. It feels like any other toy at any other store. I mean, it's plasticky, but it's not crazy. More batteries in this guy. I wanted him to fly. <laughs> you see how my expectations are way out of hand? I wanted him to fly and say all his famous lines. Does he talk? It's a very basic controller, just one button. Look how cute he is. For $5, this was a steal. This is a great little gift for somebody. Go see how much this is at Walmart. Is this helmet open? Oh, I love it. Ready? Does he need batteries? Oh, it's my fault. Of course he needs batteries, silly girl. How is he gonna move without batteries, Vivian? We can never get it open. The screw back here behind this guy is impossible. No wonder it was on sale. I thought it was 50% off because it's like a Christmas gift, but it was too good to be true. Look how cute he is. But it's cute if you just want him like that. For $5, I guess you got yourself a Buzz Lightyear, but four out of the five products that I've tried today have been a fail. A handful of times that that's ever happened in all of the years that I've done this. Five below, you're gonna get downgraded in Vivian Heads all together as a company based on this experience. So. I'm gonna give Mr. Buzz Lightyear one Vivian head. Four Vivian heads gone because it doesn't work. Scented candle cereal. How cute is this? Did they copy a small business owner? I've seen a lot of people on the internet like start candle companies making cereal and they're so good. They include a spoon in everything. Well now Five Below will sell you the kit. <laughs> if you wanna start that business, it's gonna bring a bowl, a mold, flavors of vanilla, cherry, lemon, and orange. It's gonna bring a bag of soy wax three candle wicks. I'm so upset with you guys today. I below, I'm talking to you. Ew, that's a lot of wax, okay. There's your mold. See, this is the kind of crap that makes me think half of the stuff has been returned or something. I know this is not my bowl of cereal. Out of hand, like you guys are out of control. This is my bowl of cereal. I wanted my bowl of cereal. <laughs> as big as the box at least. I need one wick. I don't need three. There's not even room to put three. I'm gonna put one. When I burn it, I'm gonna do another candle. Use one, save the others for next time. The amount of wax is pretty decent. This is your mold for your little cereal. Oh, that's super cute. Textured inside and everything. Add a small amount of boiling water onto a large bowl with a fourth cup of wax chips. So this is gonna take some time because they're saying that once you get everything melted, you need to at least give it an hour to dry. So for now, I'm gonna give you my first impressions. So far, it's okay, but I am gonna go ahead and make everything take my time so that it looks beautiful. So for each of these, it's gonna take about an hour for each flavor. So I'm gonna need more than just an hour of filming to get this done. Follow me on Instagram or on Facebook. Facebook. I'll post the video there, but just based on the first impression, it's super cute. I just wish this was a little bit bigger. People think they're getting a full bowl of cereal. I mean, look at this. So just based on the first impression, I'm gonna give the cereal bowl wax kit three Vivian heads, and I might add or subtract Vivian heads depending on the end result. I'll update you guys on Instagram or Facebook. If you wanna continue watching videos like this one, I recommend you watch this one next.